हाई गाइज दिस इज मेघा वर्मा वेलकम टू माई चैनल सो इन टूडेज टूटोरियल वी विल लर्न हाउ टू डिज़ाइन दिस रेस्टोरों पैप बैनर इन कॉरल रॉ सो विदाउट एनी डीले लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट एड सो दिस इज द साइज ऑफ आर वेब बैनर Now first we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a rectangle. Now we will set the size of the rectangle. Now we will set the align of the rectangle. First we will click on specified point, then align center horizontally and align center vertically. Now we will drag the rectangle like this and we will right click to make a copy. Now we'll right click and we will select convert to curves. Now we'll select the shape tool. Now we will double click to delete the node. Now we will drag this node. Now we'll fill black color. Now we'll select the rectangle and we will fill white color. Now we'll make a copy of this triangle shape. We will drag and right click. Now we'll click on mirror horizontally and mirror vertically. Now we will select the rectangle and the triangle to align. First we'll click on selected object, then align from the top and align from the right. Now we'll select the polygon tool from the toolbar. Now we'll make a six point polygon shape. We will press control key and we will draw. Now we'll place here. Now we will adjust the size. Now we will change the color of the outline. Now we will increase the size of the outline. Now we will drag outside with the shift key and we will right click to make a copy. Now we will select the outer shape and we will go to the effects menu and we will select creative. Now we will select the scatter option. You can see the adjustment and then we will click on OK. Now we will select both and we will adjust the size. Now we will make a copy of this shape by drag and right click. Now we will decrease the size. Now we will decrease the size of the outline. Now we will drag inside with the shift key and we will right click to make a copy. Now we will change the color of the outline. Now we will select the outer shape and we will press control page down to send back. Now we'll select this rectangle and we will change the color. Now we'll remove the outline. Now we'll select the black polygon shape and we will fill white color. Now we'll select both and we will adjust the position. Now we'll make copy by drag and right click and we will place here. Now again we will make one more copy and we will place here. Now we will decrease the size. Now we will select the outer shape and we will give a white color to the outline. Now 
Now we will select this shape and we will fill white color. Now we have these images. Now we will place. Now first select this image and we will increase the size. Now we'll place like this and we will right click. Now we'll select power clip inside. Now we'll place in this white rectangle. Now we'll click on add it. Now we'll select this image. Now we will now we'll select the transparency tool from the toolbar. Now we will increase the transparency. Now we'll adjust. Now we'll click on finish. Now we'll select the second image and we will increase the size. Now we will right click and we will again select power clip inside. Now we'll click on this shape then we will click on add it. Now we'll place the image according to the shape. We will adjust. Then click on finish. Now similarly we will place all the images now we'll select this and we will make a copy now we'll select the outer shape and we will change the outline color now we'll place these images We will adjust this pizza image. Now we will select the outer shape and we will fill black color. Now we will select the inner shape and we will change the color of the outline. And we will fill black color. Or place like this. Now we have all these details. Now I'll place this. First, we will make a copy of this shape and we will place here. Now we'll change the color and we will remove the outline. Now we'll select with the rectangle and we will align from the top. Now again we will make one more copy. Now we will right click and we will select convert to curves. Now we will select the shade tool. Now we will select the nodes like this. And we will drag with the right arrow key. Now we will adjust the height. Now first we will place the logo. I will place the restaurant name. Now we will place the heading. Now we will place the paragraph text. Now we will select both and we will press C to align center. Now we will place the website.
now we will adjust the size of the text now we'll change the color now we'll select the rectangle and we will remove the outline now we'll select this text and the shape and we will press it to align center so guys our rest of web banner design is ready i hope you like the design if you have any question regarding this tutorial you can ask me on the comment box please like share and comments and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get updates of my videos thanks for watching